I guess a lot of it was a little bit of a warning to people. I mean, that sounds kind of negative <laughs> to be warning our students, but there is a need for it right now. We're going to be going in the union to attend an event called My Lease Says What? And it's going to be an informational session for students about off-campus housing. This time of year, and maybe even a little earlier, students are looking around for some place to live the next school year. So in the spring, maybe early spring, um, is the time that students really ought to be informed about the issues in Laramie as far as landlord-tenant market and what they should be looking for and all that sort of related stuff. The lease has really become the primary thing that students should concentrate on. What does that lease say? Um, do they understand it? Do they have questions? And of course, if they do have questions or inquiries, don't sign it until they're satisfied. You know, they got proper answers to their questions and stuff. I attended because I'm looking for uh, a new place to live off campus next year. I knew that I'd get really good information about uh, what to look for in leases. And since I'd never looked like really, really closely at leases before, and I've had encounters with landlords that are tough, um, I knew she'd be able to help out and tell me what to look for. So Students will kind of blindly sign leases and get trapped in something that's really not good for them because their landlord just wants their money. I have a few friends who are stuck in campus habitat and they don't have heat and I kind of want to know the legality of that and how the landlord can come and just put a space heater in their apartment and call it good. Uh, the best part I found was when she went over the specific parts of some leases that you need to be aware of this and um, things are worded in a different way. That it's hard to, they, they kind of make it hard to understand, but when you look for this correct wording, then you're able to see that, oh, this is something I should be aware of. Like the red flags, like things that your landlord can do, like they can enter your apartment or your house at any time without notice. Like that's something students need to be aware of. It was really helpful for me to know my rights uh, if the landlord breaks something, like who I can go to or what would be the next step for me to try and rectify the situation. This is another side to the university as far as educating um, in life issues rather than your academic issues. You know, we do have that side of the university. Um, so I do think it's important.